This news is tracking developing news out of Providence. We first told you about Live at Five. We've learned a 21-year-old man is on life support after being shot in the head on Baker Street this afternoon. It is the latest in a string of shootings in the capital city, new at six. We're hearing from the mayor for the very first time on how he won't tolerate violence in the capital city. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik is live in Providence where she's recently learned the identity of the victim. Well, yeah, we are learning tonight that that victim is 21-year-old Devin Young. He is from Providence. Right now, he is on life support. We do want to show you he was shot right beyond that metal fence there in the back of the driveway here, right off of Baker Street. He was shot around 1 o'clock today. We're told he was in a car at the time when he was shot in close proximity. Now, coincidentally, there happened to be a Providence patrol officer right over here in the Family Dollar parking lot right off of Broad Street. When those shots rung out, he heard the gunfire, and then he rushed over to help. When police arrived at the driveway of 236 Baker Street, someone known to 21-year-old Devin Young was already driving him to the hospital. Police say Young was shot in the head in close proximity in broad daylight while many people were around. I just heard somebody got shot and I came down here to find out what's going on. Neighbors heard the gunfire. I just heard the, the, shot, the gun shot and then... You heard the gunshot? Yes, I did. How many did you hear? Two. You heard two gunshots? Yeah. And in a twist of events, a patrolman happened to be in the nearby Family Dollar parking lot when that shooting happened. He heard the gunfire and followed the victim's car as it sped off to the hospital. We can tell you the victim's car collided with another car on the way. Late this afternoon, Mayor Angel Tavares calling an impromptu meeting condemning today's shooting and the recent violence. A young man was shot in the head today. He was sitting in his car, shot in the head. This was not a mistake. This was an intentional, senseless act of violence. People are not respecting human life, and it must stop. Police say this was a targeted shooting. Right now, no suspects have been caught, and the mayor says he is committed to finding the person or people responsible. Reporting live tonight from the Mobile Newsroom, the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Catherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.